All right, all right, ladies, gentlemen, citizens of the Empire, welcome back to Assassin's Creed Origins. I hope all the uh, technical shit has kind of worked itself out. OBS did an update before I started, so maybe, just maybe, we're good. I tried to fix as much as I could, but if you don't really know what the problem is, you can't fix shit. All right, let's check this out. There's just patrols everywhere. Cut through the horses. Hey, Hello, sir. Egyptian, come see. What am I seeing? I heard Sarinakan horses are the best in the world. They are. Which is why that cursed Roman quartermaster stole my prized stallion, Hermes. Hermes wasn't only my fastest horse, but my best breeder. The mares miss him. I miss him. I'll pay you. You want me to rescue a horse? I love him like a brother. Actually, my brother's a donkey's arse. I love him more than my brother. <laughs> that drunken thief quartermaster is probably already at the Archile Pantochian by now. It's on the road to Alexandria. Could you find Hermes and bring him home to me? Wait, on the road to Alexandria? Jesus, that's... it's kind of far. <laughs> I mean, I guess you can call that on the road to Alexandria. Excuse me, excuse me. Oh, uh, forget. See what we can find. What trouble we can get into. You know, when I talk about getting into trouble, I don't mean bandit att attacks on the road. Romans about you can stop me yep like right there a few over there any others who'd be a problem all right I can think I think we can take the rooftops up and if we play our cards right, we might even be able to jump down on top of the horse and just ride out of here. Or we can assassinate them. That, that works. No, gear, gear, gear. I have poison darts, right? No, I have sleeping darts. That still works. 
That must be the thieving quartermaster. The quest for armies continues. Did I track oil through there? Yes, I did. Okay, let's see where we need to go from here. Seems kind of far. Oh, come on. Come on. Just quit fucking around. Oh, of course he's at a camp. Gotta love it. They always take it to a camp. Why wouldn't you? Might as well scope out the positions here. Any hidden entrances or... Huh, only two defenders at the main gate. That could be a... Nope. This. This. What is this? Oh, this is for the camp. Never mind. Sometimes you can find a cave. Oh, oh the horse is actually coming out. I think we should wait and intercept. Whoa. Oh shit, that, that was the wrong button. Oh, damn it. Whoa. Oh, shit. No, 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 you bastard. There we go. Oh, dear Lord. <laughs> it set everything on fire. Holy shit. Just leave. Just leave. That was a clean ish. Get yeah, never mind. No, no, it wasn't. I lied. There we go. Well, that made it cleaner. So, what's so special about you, Hamis? All right, Hamis. Ah, there's a good boy. The way your master talked about you, I half expected you to fly, eh? Huh? <laughs> uh. Ah, that's it, boy! You do feel more powerful than other horses I've ridden. Oh, Strong shit. Strong and light. They burned down the place? <laughs> Hermes, my boy. You really found him. Yeah, I did. Here you are, boy. Back with your master. Hermes, you'll get the best hay and my best bear tonight, old friend. Quartermaster gave him to the Centurion up at the East Fort. He won't come looking for him. Those forts, they steal everything from us. Ah, well, we will breed a strong line of champions from you, won't we, boy? Here is your award, friend. And well earned. Sweet. Short and simple. Or kind of simple, I suppose. Was this a new skin for the horse? Let's 
try it. Alright, boy, let's go. Uh, I kind of want to grab this, and since we're over here, we can hit that. That sort of looks like an arena or a temple. I don't exactly know what it is, but we'll see. Okay. Well, I haven't met Leander, and I don't think he has anything for me, so I'm just gonna sink up here and get the fuck off his pro property. So we might as well just is that? Is that wait a minute, is that That's the fort, oh my god. Okay. Relax. You know I've played so much Red Dead Redemption that I Occasionally still click the button to calm my horse Even though it doesn't do a damn thing in any other game I just do it by instinct This one again. I'm trying to find the brazier. Ah. Now I just need to mark it. Oh, there is a t <clears throat> excuse me, a tunnel entrance, but it's on the other side. All right, well, easily enough, I can make my way around without causing too much trouble or suspicion, Whoa. and climb my way up to the brazier and the mission. Oh shit. No, I can't I can't get him, I don't think. <laughs> I'll just keep it nice and slowish. Quiet and easy. help me. Hold on, hold on. Oh, Gloria, protector of Egypt, please. We are in grave danger. Stop shouting. You are Hati, yes? I will not ask how you knew. But for the future of Egypt, we must flee. How did you find me, Majad? Did the spy master send you? The Centurion's list led me here. 
All right. Let's get him out of here. As safely as I possibly can. And out we go. I think that was the easiest rescue I've ever done. Oh. You have the list? The names of the shrouded ones in Cyrenaica? Yes. You and another of Apollodorus' agents survived. I freed him from the barracks in Balagre. You have done Egypt and Apollodorus a great service, Magi. Amun Ra reward you. Thank you. Let's, uh, let's get you down. You can figure it out from here, right? Okay, so we're gonna go back to Cyrene. Dead in the water. I wanna do, like, the rest of these side quests before we do basically anything else. All right. Oh, yay, another trial of Sobek. Well, of the gods, I guess. I forget the actual moniker they used for the promotion. Uh, the mousetrap. That'll do. Suppose we could... Wait, what's this? The Flea of Cyrene. And we'll, we'll eventually get to them all anyway, so... Who even really cares all that much? Which one we do in order? I really need to get a green screen. I have no idea how to set it up, but but I need to get one. Even just to do random shitty Even memes. When your kind appears to triumph, still shall we get many Egyptians in Cyrene. You'll get no judgment from the mouse, but you did stick out. The mouse. Okay. Not title, my friend. Yes, yes, I am the mouse because I can access the more hard to find trinkets. If you follow me to my shop, I'll show you. Our bows, blades, scepters, you won't be disappointed. The mouse guarantees it. Sir. Bayek. All right. Let's see what you have, mouse. Uh, I Don't you think have something else romance? is better than mouse. Well, you know what they say about our Latin friends? The Greeks invented the threesome, and the Romans added women. <laughs> <laughs> Besides, I know how to stay hidden, Sir Bayek. With the way I look, I have to. People think the mouse is unlucky. They don't see I am an entrepreneur and savior. I mean, well, you got a giant scar on your face. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's the last of them. You want to explain, Mouse? The Roman swine must have taken my chest to the barracks. Please, will you recover it? And why would I do that? Because you know what it's like to be brushed aside, victimized by those who hold themselves above you. The mouse will die on the streets with no living to support him. And what of the children? Will no one think of the children? And I could probably spare a fine reward for my savior. I would not want the children on my conscience. God bless you, Sir Bayek. I will wait for you in the market behind the baths. Good luck, my friend. All right. Well, let's help him and the children out. He seems sort of like a child at heart. Barracks. 
Oh, for once it's a small bear, it's not a giant fort. Come on, let's get it all. Wait, where's the brazen? Oh, it just hadn't popped in yet. You gotta love that draw distance. I don't want any surprises. Alright, so maybe... Well, I could drop down from there, but I have a feeling it's a giant restricted area. Um... I could take the wall. Oh shit, oh shit. Damn it. Well, at least. They're not going for that brazier. Really? Did they? Okay, they got freed. All right, let's let's set this ablaze. There we go. Son of a bitch! At the last moment. Really, the fire is not going to do it. Find a way down. Any arrows up here? No. There's a chest. Let's get this the since we're at it. I need to try to get this out of here, Jesus. That's not going to be very easy. <laughs> Screw it. Let's make a break for it. Bye. Oh no, he's inside. 
It looked like he was outside the city walls. What if they just kill a random person? Quickly, quickly. Don't worry, Mouse. They're not going to find us. There you go. Ah, Bayek. Did you find my You have saved my life for a second time, Sir Bayek. I am blessed. Blessed by the gods who brought you to me on this, the greatest of days. The Mouse will embrace you as a sign of my undying gratitude. Ah, uh, please don't. Then, money, I will shower you with riches to make Chris jealous. Take care of yourself, Mouse. Try not to get caught in any more traps, eh? Ah, such grace, such wit. You deserve more than mere money. Come see me again later. I will find you something special from my stash. Sounds good. Sir Bayek, my eyes weep in joy at the sight of you. Did you hear? Some black market merchant is trying to undercut me. I did not. You want to tell me about it? No? No? Okay. Well, back at it again. All right, what is this? The flea. Is it someone else selling black market items or is it something different? It's on the top of the building. I guess I can get the viewpoint. Wait, is this a viewpoint? Yes. Oh. Somebody's watching me. Friends call me Essio. Ah, oh, that's well, clever. Essio, I am Bayek. How did you do that? Are you magic? Will you leave some more for me and my friends? I can tell you about my home, the most amazing city of Cyrene as we go. Sure. How can I refuse such a gracious offer? Lead the way, Essio. Me and my gang will give you the grand tour, Bayek. Your gang? You have a gang? <laughs> yes. I'm the most important child in Cyrene. Really? I can see that, Essio. Let's go to the baths. It's where people walk around naked, being scraped and scratched and rubbed with oils. I hate getting my hair wet. Don't you, Bayek? Yeah, it's not That's pleasant. why I shaved it off, Essio. <gasps> and washing behind the ears, I bet. <laughs> yes. Some fancy Roman from the Citadel built it. <clears throat> Vivitu. Well, anyway. He spent 10,000 drachma on a floor made of little squares. All of that for some way you wash. When I grow up, I'm going to have a wife who'll never make me wash. Okay, but Wives like that are hard to find, this. Very hard. All right, up we go. you'd missed the cart, but I never doubted you. I didn't even use I the cart. I wasn't sure myself, Essio. So where next? You're Egyptian, right? My father says you don't worship the same gods as we Greeks. No. We have some in common. I have like never Serapis. seen the like. One oh, or yes, two. Serapis. I've heard of him. 
Apollo is all Greek and my favorite. He likes poetry, music, wine, and all that kind of stuff. He swoops through the air. But I like him because he has a bow and arrow and he likes to hunt. Do you like to hunt, Bayek? I dabble. I do. I used to hunt with my boy, Essio. If you jump from his temple there, then maybe he'll be watching from Mount Olympus and reward me with my own bow and arrow so I can hunt rabbits in the woods. I would like to see that. I'm sure somebody would make you this one. Is it? Isn't the Bayek doesn't really have any that's the size of a child. <laughs> I'm gonna jump from up there. All right, kids. We're all watching. I can't watch. Tell me when it's over. Ah, relax. So brave. Have you ever seen someone so brave? Oh shit. And I'm the one who found him. Apollo is sure to reward me now. You did it! You did it! Yes, I did. Alfred Bayek does the impossible! Let's go to the next jump. I have one Apollo last piece in his mind for you, Bayek. Are you Bacos. ready for your greatest and like challenge? Raven, let the people well, that of depends. To Libya. You think I can do it? I believe you can do anything, Bayek. Oh, this is the cutest I'm thing ever. I'm glad we joined Essio's gang. This is unbelievable. Wait till I tell my sister about today. Well, you did promise a challenge, Essio. Nobody's allowed up there except the Romans. But you look like you can handle a few measly bucket heads. Oh, Are I can. I yeah. it properly. I've killed quite a few Romans in my Serious time. Of limits. <clears throat> no, no. No, I want to actually climb up this side. There we go. <laughs> Forget this day, Bayek. We should honor it. I officially name you the Flea of Cyrene. Okay. <laughs> I will treasure it. Goodbye, Essio. Though you should Stay probably jump in that water yourself. I can't promise, but I will try for you, Great Flea. I hope you get to hunt with your son again soon. So do I, Essio. Bayek! Mouse? They are going to kill me! Shut up! You're convicted of murder! They have the wrong man! I'm as innocent as a babe! Oh shit! Oh no 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 no! Pick him up, pick him up, pick him up! Non te ha! Thank you, Sir Bayek. Get me out of this bloody cage! I'm hurt! Oh damn it! <laughs> All right, Miles, what's up? There's a real murderer out there. He's killing my friends. Slow down and tell me what happened, Mouse. I was at the bathhouse meeting some associates, and suddenly a legion accosted me. Didn't you plead your innocence? They wouldn't listen! They accused me of killing Paulus Aurelius, the moneylender, gutted like a pig. Red hair in his fist, not my hair. I met with him, yes, but when I left the baths, he was very much alive, drinking and whoring as usual. I am many things, but not a killer! It is all right, Mouse. I believe you. But the Romans will not believe a cripple and an Egyptian. Have faith. Stay low and wait for me at the gardens of the Temple of Zeus. I mean, you'll be clues to the real killer at the bathhouse. You're not crippled. You're a little bit. You, you've got a scar. It looks like a burn scar, but and eh, whatever. They won't. They wouldn't believe us anyway. He's right. Well, I see a clear entry into the bathhouse. 
I know Smintos is not the murderer, but I must discover who is. The Romans have closed off the baths. <laughs> okay, so this I'm is where he was blood. murdered. The body has been moved. I need to find it. The murderer left a message. They will all pay for their crimes. Someone is seeking justice. Well, let's see about what. This trigel has blood on it. Could be the murder weapon. <laughs> a scattering of beads. Someone broke their necklace. Did Paulus Aurelia struggle with a woman? Red hair, but it is horse hair. Maybe from a wig. That is why Smintos was falsely accused. Hmm. Somebody's clearly framing him. And now we just need to find the body, right? Here, gotta go down. No, <clears throat> Oh no. <gasps> the stench of death. And something else. Perfume. Oh, more blood's about to Ego, be added to the crime scene. <laughs> nope, nope, move. There we go. Good thing they can't open unopenable doors. <laughs> what will you tell me, Paulus Aurelius? Something is stuffed down his throat. Oh shit, I have not. to. Okay. Hmm. I will cleanse Cyrene of the hedonist. My next tragedy will strike down Cyrene's greatest actor, Metrobius. And it is signed Vesta. 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 What is your problem with pleasure seekers? I need to find this actor before this murder. Fun of me being bold if an actor were to die. Alright. There's the amphitheater. <sighs> Why is Vesta targeting these men? Would she be a prostitute killing off her clients? Yeah, but for what purpose? There we go. Now I just need to see if I can climb up the wall. Get rid of that lion before I can confirm my suspicions. Oh shit. But I think that is Vesta's second victim. Yes, the Egyptians. The murderer's second victim. There's not much left of him. Another note. Petrobius took his final bow. Only the horror remains. And he will die at the wolf's den. This Vesta has a flair for the dramatic. The horror's wolf's den must be the local brothel. My instincts were right. Vesta's a prostitute, but she's looking for her father. I only hope I find him before she does. Well, 
Let's see, how far is it from me? On the other side of town. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Fuck. Andrea Kikoen. Almost there. Nope, it's around the corner. I'm too late. Another note. This must be the horror. Father. You die. You will be quiet now, mother. By the gods, this Vesta is insane. Schizophrenic, maybe? It's all finished. And I will join our father soon. I cannot stop. And I will not live without her. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Some Norman Bates esque shit. Hmm. Whoa. Vesta was not a prostitute, but the forgotten son of one. I hope the Duat figures you out. I should return <laughs> to Smintos. Yeah, let's go. Tell him his name's cleared. Or, well, Papa, the murderer Papa. is dead, at least. Oh! We're having a hell of a time. Oh. 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 Slender arrows are lodged in my heart. Love vexes the chest that it has seized. Shall I surrender or stir up the sudden flame by fighting it? Where is he? Oh, hidden in the bushes. Bayek, did you find the killer? Yes, the son of a prostitute. When his mother died, terrible grief overtook him. He believed a car would not let him rest until he found his father. He's dead? I am sorry, Mouse. He could not be reasoned with. I have his letters. The story they tell is a tragic one. Poor boy. Such sadness. <coughs> what will you do? Won't the Romans be searching for you? I have a plan. A new life in Apollonia, where you can taste the sea it is so close. Find me there if you can, Sir Bayek. Good luck, Mouse. Okay, well that's done. We got one more side quest, I think. A love poem. Ah, there is no end to Flavio's sick games. And then we'll get to the final weighing. Get up, Leon, via! Do you do this? anthropon. Oh, okay, he better. No, I wanna head over to the blacksmith for a second. Or is it the tailor that I need to go to that sell, I can sell things to? 
sell the junk. Oh my. Where's the... Are they inside? Okay, so it's probably both. That's done. The two more battles. Philakitai, please. Are you a protector? I am not a Philakitai. I am a Medjai. Oh yes, of course. I should have noticed. These people don't understand. Our Roman friends do not take kindly to civil disobedience. Why are they protesting? They fear all is not well with our founder, the great Batos. The centurion locked his tomb. Some say he desecrated the dead in there, left a scrawled note on the door and sauntered back to the Acropolis. Please. Someone should investigate without alerting the Romans. And if that someone were to find anything, they could meet me here, and I'd be happy to help. All right, well, I'll take a look. Let's take a look. Greeks also treat their dead with great honor. And now, they suffer like Egyptians. Yeah, that's sort of what happens when people occupy you. And there is a great difference between conquer and integrate than occupy and exploit. And stupid is a troublesome combination. Yeah, but it's a common one. <laughs> Have the Romans no respect for the dead? Not other people's dead. The tomb's been ransacked. The Romans were looking for something. Light the torch. There we go. What? <laughs> Not gonna narrate for me, Bayek. Something is missing. must have been buried with these treasures. The Bowen Medallion are gone. The Romans are little more than tomb robbers. The Greeks are learning what it feels like to be Egyptian. Have your land, your dead, and your relics desecrated by an invading force. Yeah. They're figuring it out. That's a real question. How do I climb out of here? But it seems fairly straightforward. <laughs> I 
this is gonna be an ordeal. Well, if I just stay on the wall, <coughs> excuse me, on the wall, I should be able to avoid direct detection. I should not be seen in this area. Ah, right, well, that, that. Maria Mini, Morse, Vel Aliter. the bow of Batos. And finally for the last piece. Uh. <coughs> Batos medallion. The priest will be glad to see the relics returned. Mm-hmm. Now all I can do is get out of here. I think I've killed my way to a smooth exit. Or almost killed my way to a smooth exit. There we go. Quick and quiet. Only one person really saw me. And he's dead. Huh, babe. Here you are, sir. Your suspicions were well founded. The Romans took Batos' treasure. You have a relics? I do. They were not given the respect they were due. Those filthy desecrators. I will keep Bato's medallion safe. Legend says if it leaves the city, so will our fortunes. And Dibo? It longs to be in the service of Sarinaica again. Please, keep it. And maybe teach the Romans a lesson in honoring the dead. Sure. Huh. Gladly. The Founder sent you to us. Farewell, Magi. Farewell. All right, well, ladies, gentlemen, citizens of the Empire, thank you so very much for joining me. When we return, we will see about what else we can uh, get up to in Cyrene. I think there's like one or two things that we need to do in in the city still. I don't know. I forget. It's um had something to do with uh, Proxila's friend, I think. Maybe. I don't know. We'll see. But uh, uh, thank you so very much. For watching if you're on youtube please like comment subscribe on twitch drop me a follow if you haven't already and i will be back in a moment <laughs>